You asked? And we answered. Today, I'm gonna to share a ton of stylish summer fashion finds, all of them affordable. Hi ladies, it's Erin and welcome back to my channel. Today I want to share a summer lookbook of sorts, but in this summer lookbook in particular, everything is, well, with one exception, under $150. So I really wanted to make a concerted effort to find pieces that weren't just, you know, okay, that pieces that are special, that are, you know, modern, that are current, but also very affordable and accessible. And there is quite a range in terms of price point. So hopefully there's something in here for everyone. I also wanted to provide a variety of outfit ideas for different scenarios. So there's everything from, you know, the casual summer everyday outfit to office attire. All right, are you ready? Let's do it. Let's get started. The first category I want to talk about are tops, specifically tees. So there are two white tees that I found that also come in a bunch of other colors, by the way, that I feel are elevated basics. And by that, I mean that they're basics. A white tee is a basic, but there are some design details or details on the garment that makes it a little bit more modern, makes it a little more interesting, makes it a little more stylish and intentional. So the first tee by Steve Madden is ribbed and fitted through the body, which is a really nice look. And then it has these beautiful eyelet short sleeves that I think these are what make it special. The fit, the ribbing, and the sleeves, all of it together. And the great thing is it does look like a summer top. It looks like a blouse that you would buy, but it really does fit and feel like a tee. I paired this with some jeans. These jeans are by Grey Lab, which is a brand that I had only recently heard of. I like that these are a lighter wash, which also feels summery and more modern. And then the cuff detail's really cool. Finishing off the look with some New Balance white sneakers. Remember I talked about in my European videos recently how the white sneaker in particular is very on trend and not going anywhere anytime soon. So it would be still a great time to invest in a pair of white sneakers. You'll wear them all summer. You'll wear them into even fall, winter. You can wear them year round for as long as you can keep them clean essentially. In this pair, it is more of a fabric. So it might be a little bit tougher to keep clean than let's say a leather pair. <clears throat> I really love the look of this retro New Balance sneaker. And I also love that it is affordable at under a hundred dollars. So if you haven't already invested in a pair of white sneakers, I think this would be a really great way to go. The other nice thing about the tee is that it's layerable. You can easily layer a sweater over it. In this case, just a little cropped striped cashmere sweater from J. Crew. You can do a crop blazer over it. You can do a long line blazer over it. You could do a denim jacket over it. You just have a lot of options. It's very versatile. Again, with basics, with your wardrobe basics, you will have that versatility because they really are those foundational pieces that will mix and match seamlessly into your wardrobe. So if you really want some elevated tees, you know, just to kind of throw on with shorts or jeans, I feel like this is one of the ways you can go. The other way you can go is this J. Crew Henley tee. And this one is $32. This one really caught my eye because it is almost an exact dupe for one by Veronica Beard. Is the quality the same? Is the fabric thickness the same? Are the details exactly the same? No, but they look really similar. And the J. Crew tee comes in 13 other colors. So if you don't want white, you want a different color, you can easily do that. The nice thing about these tees is both of them do fit and feel like a tee, but they both look like blouses, like stylish summer blouses. So if you want that blouse look, but you want the fit and feel of the tee and the versatility of a tee, these are two really solid options. With the J. Crew tee, I paired it with some linen DL 1961 shorts. These shorts I brought with me to Africa. I've been wearing them a ton already, even though it, it's still pretty chilly here. <laughs> and they're on sale right now. So they're 118 on sale. And then some Sam Edelman sandals. These are in saddle brown or saddle leather, and they come in 13 other colors. So this is just, an, again, one of those things that you would buy for summer, but if you keep it in pretty good condition, you'll wear it again and again and again and again, and then you wear it next summer. It's just gonna be really versatile for you. Okay, now let's get more into traditional tops versus tees. The first one I wanna show you is actually a bodysuit that's wrap front. Wrap front is such a flattering cut on so many different body shapes, particularly with women with larger busts. You've got that nice elongating V neckline. The fit is quite fitted. The fabric is, is interesting because it doesn't wrinkle. It's very silky on the skin. 
The nice thing about this top is you can wear it alone and it has sort of a sexy but also classic feel. And then you can also layer it under things. So it's not gonna be a piece you're gonna wear exclusively in the summertime or in the spring. It's gonna be a piece that you can wear throughout the year. So I have a couple of these I don't know, I've had it for years, and wear it just over and over and over again. In this look, I paired it with some high-rise cropped white jeans. These jeans are really nice, by the way, because they don't have the pockets in the front, so they really do have that nice streamlined look. They are quite high-rise, and if the tummy area is a worry for you, these will definitely exaggerate a lower tummy. What you could do is just like skip the bodysuit and wear a top that is a little longer, the hemline's a little longer, and wear it out, so then that way you can kind of mask that lower tummy. I finished off the look with the J. Crew Raffia belt. Raffia, super, super on trend right now. And some Sam Edelman Raffia platforms. These are the one thing in the video that are a little bit higher than 150. I think they're 160. But I wanted to show them to you because they're so special and they add so much crazy height. They're like five and a half inches. So if you're petite like me and you wanna add height and you don't wanna compromise on comfort, these are fabulous shoes. Next up is this really sweet white cotton eyelet top. This is by Aqua, which is an in-house brand for Bloomingdale's. It's $78. Unfortunately, most of the sizes are sold out, but don't worry, I've got another one that's very similar I'm gonna show you in a minute. I paired this eyelet blouse with some Banana Republic cargo pants, which I've showed you guys before. Remember, I showed you these in one of my spring lookbook videos that I did. Paired that with the same Sam Edelman brown sandals. Again, these Sam Edelman sandals are so versatile, so comfortable, so neutral. You'll wear them again and again and again. And if you take decent care of them like I have, you'll wear them every summer. It's not something that's gonna go out of style. And these come in a ton of colors, like 13 other colors. Okay, so remember I told you I was gonna show you a blouse that was similar to the Aqua one, but had more sizes in stock. This one by Sanctuary Cotton Eyelet Blouse. a Little bit higher neck and doesn't have that open neckline. It's also a little more sleeveless. So that's just something to think about. I don't know how you're feeling about your arms. This one is around the same price as the Aqua one at 79 and just a very sweet, pretty blouse. It would be easy to throw on with shorts, easy to throw on with jeans, easy to layer under things. So again, just another neutral, versatile, basic piece, but all of the details give it a little extra something special. So the eyelet details, all those like cut out details really make it quite special and pretty. Okay, the next top I wanna show you is for those of you who really love the boho style, although I don't think you have to be someone who's drawn to boho to appreciate this blouse. This is by Free People. It is a really thick cotton and it's called the Yucca Blouse. I wanted to show you just two different ways. And again, all of these white tops, the tees and the white blouses, can all be easily worn with jeans or shorts. So here it is with the same jeans I showed you before by Grey Lab. And then again, with the shorts that I showed you from DL 1961 and those same Sam Edelman sandals. So you'll see the same shoes, the same bottoms throughout this whole video. I just wanna show you again, the versatility of some of these pieces and how you can really wear them day in and day out. The next top I wanna show you is actually the one I'm wearing right now. It's by a line called Bobby, B-O-B-I. And it is this really lovely, soft, gauzy cotton. You can wear it off the shoulder like I am, or you can wear it on the shoulder. It's cropped, it has a lot of elastic, it's very comfortable, it's very breathable. And I wanted to show you this set, because it comes with pants that match, and I feel like it's just like the perfect outfit for the beach or the lake or wherever you're going this summer, the pool. It's so breezy, so fun, so chic, so stylish. I paired it with the Sam Edelman Gold Flats. It's just such a lovely outfit, so comfortable, so chic. You're gonna absolutely love wearing this. I actually bought this at one of the local stores here and I was like, please have this online, please have this online. So when I saw that you could get it online, I was so happy that I could share it with you guys because it's just like the quintessential, cool, classic, chic summer outfit. The next time I want to show you is a little bit more on this, like could be like fall, winter, but it also is just year round and it's so special and so lovely that I couldn't not show it to you. 
that's a double negative, but you get the point. <laughs> it's by Norma Kamali, and what I love about it are these strong, structured shoulders. So this is something that you could wear on date night, feel a little extra special with those shoulder pads, and then wear a fabulous necklace or some great earrings. It really does provide sort of that perfect canvas for a gorgeous necklace. And I just love the structure of the top, but yet that fabric is wrinkle resistant, travels beautifully, fitted to the body in that dark color, it's very flattering. So you could do this with either black and go for an all black look, which again, here where I live, I could easily pull off. I mean, right now it's like still like 45 degrees outside, which I know it's, it's, it's even hard for me to take, but <laughs> for those of you who live in really hot climates, you may not want to do an all black look. So you could do black and white and that's a very classic look. The fabric on this top is so paper thin. It's not going to add heat. It's not going to add bulk. So those are two things to consider too. It's also going to layer under things. Obviously, if you have strong shoulders already, you may not need that strong shoulder detail, but for me personally, I absolutely love a strong shoulder. The Norma Kamali top is 115 and these are the same white jeans I just showed you. And these black jeans are by Mango and it's a crop fit high rise, really nice pair of jeans. And these come in a couple of other colors as well. If you're interested in some more affordable jeans, Mango is a great price point. They do have an eye on sustainability. So it's a brand that you can feel good about shopping at a lower price point. You know, you just want to be a little bit careful. I think at least I'm trying to be a little bit careful when I shop for lower price point items, not to buy things that just feel like fast fashion or something that's not going to hold up and I'm just going to, you know, throw it away in a couple months because it falls apart in the wash. So that's just a consideration. And that was one of the sort of lenses that I look through with all of these finds is, is this something that's going to hold up? And a lot of these pieces I have had for a long time, like the Free People bodysuit I've had for years, the Sam Adam and Sandals I've had for years. And so it's just, I really am interested at this point in also having quality pieces that will last. So that was really important to me when I was picking these pieces to show you in this video. And I just wanted to make sure you understood that. And then also another thing, and I don't think we talk about this enough, or I talk about this enough, is that you know, with your pieces, if you want them to last longer, just don't wash them as much. You don't have to wash them every single time you wear them. You know, you're wearing a sleeveless blouse and you know, your armpits are aired out. You don't necessarily need to wash that sleeveless blouse every single time you wear it, right? So by making sure that you kind of wash as minimally as possible and then wash in cold and then don't dry, you're going to create more longevity with those pieces. Okay. I really wanted to show you some lightweight summer sweaters. And for those of you who live in really hot climates, I know you're going to be like, no, I don't need a sweater. Yes, you do. Remember I lived in Texas for eight years and I swear I have never been so cold as when I was in a restaurant in the summertime in Texas. It gets really cold because everything's so heavily air conditioned. So it's really nice to have a little lightweight jacket or a little lightweight sweater that you can throw over your shoulders when you're in those air conditioned restaurants. So the first sweater is this relaxed cotton linen blend beach sweater. This is from J crew and I love this sweater so much. I wanted to share it with you because it just has such a beachy feel. And I know many of you are probably planning, you know, lake vacations or lake house trips or beach vacations, or maybe you live by the beach and you're so lucky. And so this is just a nice sweater to have to throw on for like your, your dinner by the beach or for those trips that you're going on. The sweater color is called Harvest Flax Ivory, but it comes in four other colors. It is under hundred at 98 and it's very lightweight. It's not going to overheat you because it's so lightweight. And I just love the fit. It's not too oversized. You can easily wear it with white jeans. You could wear it with white shorts. You know, again, you could tie it around your waist if you have a white dress. There's a lot of things you can do with this one. The next sweater is very similar. It just has some different details and a different print and color scheme. So this is a striped sweater also by J. Crew. This one's a little pricier at 128, I think mostly because of the print and also because of the button detailing at the shoulder. So for those of you who love the stripes, especially in the summertime, I feel like you, if you're going out to, I don't know, I feel like if you're in the Northeast or New England, like you need the striped sweater with the buttons on it. <laughs> I'm picturing you on Nantucket or Martha's Vineyard or 
Cape Cod, something like that. <laughs> I'm not going to any of those places, by the way, but I'm, I'm just visualizing you all there. I paired this sweater with some Sam Edelman gold sandals. These are just slip-on slides. I have them on right now. I'll show you these guys. They're again, very neutral, versatile. You'll wear the crap out of them. So in terms of accessories, you don't have to break the bank with accessories either. There are a couple of sunglass brands that I really love that are go-tos for accessibility in terms of price. And that would be key, Q-U-A-Y, and also list specs. I have many of each brand and they are really decent quality and again, very reasonably priced. Accessories can really be where you add some of the excitement into your look, always, always. It's just such a simple thing that you can do and it's just a little detail that makes such a big difference. This next sweater is a little less basic and a little more fun. It's an embellished crocheted sweater. This is also by Aqua from Bloomingdale's for $98 in white. I love like an open knit sweater like this for summer. I feel like it's sexy, it's breezy, it keeps you cool, but also it adds so much pop to your look. So you can have, again, the most basic outfit, just the white jeans, the white cami underneath, add the sweater and it just looks so stylish and cool. You could do a contrasting color cami or tank underneath. You could be crazy and wear a bra top or bra cami, you know, whatever you're inspired by. But this one also has some embellishment in the sweater, which was really cool. It's these little silver pops of shine in the white sweater that I thought made it a little extra special and a little different. I have on the same gold Sam Edelman slide sandals. Again, very versatile, you wear them all the time. And some really cute little brown sunglasses by Cezanne. Okay, okay. I really wanted to give a couple of office outfit ideas in an accessible price point because a lot of you have mentioned that you're back in the office, you're really looking for office outfit ideas, and especially it's especially difficult sometimes in the summertime. So I wanted to show you two options. This really is a spotlight on this Maeve grid top. It's sheer, it's so pretty with a little mock neck and a tie in the back. I love this blouse so much. I saw it, it's on Anthropology, and I thought this is like, this is like a beautiful blouse to have. You could again wear it with jeans, you could wear it with really nice trousers, you could wear it for date night with some cool black pants and heels. There's a lot you can do with it. I think you could even wear it under a vest because of the little puffy sleeve. It's sheer, so it's not gonna heat you up. I paired it with some tan office trousers. These are not under 150, but I wanted to show you these anyway because they do come in a petite length and I'm actually wearing the petite length and it's a really nice fitting, good high quality trouser. But we also found a pair that is under 150 from Banana Republic that looks very similar. So we'll put a link to that below in the description box. And we put the links in comments as well for those of you who may not be able to find the links in the description box. The next office outfit idea I wanna show you is a pinstripe suit from Bloomingdale's. I love a pinstripe suit, especially with the vertical stripes, so elongating and slimming. This is a cropped set. So it's a cropped blazer and cropped pants. I think it will look fabulous with heels, but I wanted to show you with a pair of flats just so you had that as an option. These are some older loafers that I actually got in Spain, but you could easily do a pump or a pair of really sharp or professional looking sandals if you have some. I think you have options with your footwear with this suit, but I just really love this suit in terms of how flattering it is. And it's a really great suit for those of you who might be in the sort of petite range as well. It is the blazers on sale for 41 and the matching pants are on sale for 54. So it's a really, really good price point. I'm gonna get to dresses in a minute and I have some really fabulous dresses I wanna show you that are very affordable. But one shout out for swimwear. This brand, Blue by Rod Beatty, I feel like I haven't talked about enough. I have a chocolate brown swimsuit by them that fits me like a glove, is so sexy and so flattering. So you can get a Blue by Rod Beatty one piece and they have all these different design details in the front that are really, again, sexy, but also very flattering for in the like 130 range or 120 to 130 range. So just wanted to call that out. Okay, moving on to my favorite category, 
dresses. I love dresses because they're just simple, but they're also very stylish and chic. I don't have to worry about what to wear with what. I don't have to worry about finding the separates and, you know, doing that whole thing. So it's just nice to have when you're in a little bit more of a rush or you've got something going on and you're not sure what to wear. Just throw on a beautiful dress and you're done. So the first dress I wanted to show you is an eyelet midi dress. This is from Bloomingdale's. It's $94. It's the aqua line again. And this dress I brought with me on a recent trip that I took with Chris and wore it, you know, when I was out and about during the day, loved wearing it, felt so pretty and feminine and stylish, also cool. I love that it's midi length, so it gives you a little more coverage. I love that it has a little cap sleeve. The cap sleeve is really like kind of cut in on the shoulder though. So it almost fits more like a sleeveless dress. So that's just something to think about, especially if you're broad. I don't think this dress is gonna work for you. It's gonna maybe be cheated in too far. It has a little tassel detail and you can either leave those out or tuck them in depending on what your preference is. Pair that with some Sam Edelman platforms, the one I showed you already in Raffia. And I wanted to just show you this clutch. It's definitely not in budget, but it's a really special kind of special occasion clutch. So if you are looking for something this summer, I love Raffia for summer. Again, very on trend. This is just a really cool bag by Colt Gaia. The next dress is a one shoulder midi dress, also midi, love a midi length, by Moon River for $102. Paired it with the same platforms and the same clutch. It's just really sexy, it's really simple, it's really chic. You know, it does present a little bit of a situation with the bra, but you could do some nippies or pasties, or you could do a strapless bra, no problem, if you've got a good one. We usually recommend the Wacol convertible red carpet strapless bra, if you still haven't found a decent one. But truth be told, like I don't think there's any great strapless bra out there. I've tried so many different brands and never like fallen in love with any of them. <laughs> So I just usually go for the like the, the pasties and call it a day because I, I just find strapless bras uncomfortable. But you always have that option. Next up, I wanted to show you the Michael Stars midi tank dress. This is a great one to throw on when you're running errands, but you want to look pulled together. It's a really versatile piece. I think I've had this dress for like four or five years. I remember featuring it here, I don't know, like eons ago. It seems like eons ago, I don't know. <laughs> when I was back in the old studio, so it's just a really great piece to have. You, If you take decent care of it, it's cotton, it's gonna last for a long time. It's not a trendy piece. It's not gonna go out of style. And it's just really lovely when you're traveling too and you just want a really smart dress to put on that you could wear with sneakers, that you could throw a little denim jacket or blazer over. This is a really great, layerable, versatile, everyday option. I also wanted to give you something that was really like, woo, you know, special. So if you have anything special coming up and you want something that's more affordable, here you go. It's the Norma Kamali Terra gown. It is black, ruched in the middle. It's an asymmetrical hemline. So one side is quite short, shows a lot of leg, and the other side is quite long. And then it has this beautiful off the shoulder neckline that you can also put on the shoulder if that's more comfortable for you. This again presents a little bit of a bra issue. Really want to do pasty here. If you've got a large bust, probably not going to be the dress for you. But for those of you with like mid to smaller size bust, I think it's a really special dress that does not break the bank, that really makes you feel super sexy and special. So I wore this on my trip with Chris. I wore it out to dinner and felt very like, woo, you know, it's very sexy for sure. <laughs> I paired that with the same platforms and the same clutch. I did that very intentionally because I wanted to show you the versatility again of these two pieces. The platforms are so high, so, so high. So if you're not super comfortable with heels, I wouldn't do it. But again, it does have the ankle strap and the platform makes them easier to walk in. You know, with platforms, you sort of chunk off whatever the platform looks like. So if the platform is one inch, underneath the sole of the shoe, then you're actually walking on a heel that's more like four inches, right? So for in this example, if it's five and a half inches and the platform is one, then it's really like a four and a half inch heel, which is still really high, but <laughs> it's better than it seems like it's going to be. How about that? All right, so let's recap shoes for a minute. These are all heavy hitters for me this summer that I think could be really versatile, neutral, and heavy hitters for you too this summer that you'll wear for years to come, again, if you take decent care of them. The first one are the Sam Edelman Bayside sandals. 
those I show in saddle leather, but they do come in 13 other colors. There's the Sam Edelman Haiti sandal. These are 83 in gold leaf and they come in four other colors. And then the New Balance white sneakers for 100. These also come in a variety of colors and shades. The Sam Edelman platforms are a little over the budget of 160, but I wanted to show them to you because if you have special events coming up, these are so fabulous and comfortable for the size of the heel. If you're like me and you love to add height, you're gonna love these shoes. If you're more on the pale side in terms of skin tone, they're leg lengthening. So it's just a great pair of heels. Okay, we covered a lot of ground. Let's recap really quickly and then you can kind of take an inventory like, what do I need? What do I have coming up? What appeals to me and pick and choose and see if there's something that you may want. First up, we had the tees, the Steve Madden with the eyelet sleeves. Next, the J. Crew Henley tee that looks very similar to the Veronica Beard one. The Free People bodysuit, wrap front, V neckline, very flattering, comes in 10 colors. The Aqua eyelet blouse, beautiful, so special. The Sanctuary sleeveless cotton blouse. The Free People Yucca blouse that has that boho feel. The bobby top that I'm wearing that you can wear off the shoulder or on. The Norma Kamali strong shoulder shoulder pad top. For sweaters, I showed you this linen blend beach sweater <laughs> and the striped sweater. Very similar, but very different at the same time. Also the embellished crochet sweater. For office outfit ideas, there was the Maeve sheer grid blouse that's so beautiful and the pinstripe suit. For swim, you have Anything by Blue by Rod Beatty and dresses, the eyelet midi dress from Bloomies, the one shoulder black midi dress, the black tank dress that's cotton, and the Norma Kamali gown. For shoes, we had the Bayside sandals, the Haiti sandals, the white sneakers, and the platform. Okay, so which piece was your favorite? Please share that in the comments below. Did you like this video? Was it helpful for you? Are you happy about the price points? Do you want to see lower? Do you want to see higher? Let us know. We'd really love to hear your feedback. Any amazing pieces that you found that are an accessible price point that you feel like are good quality and other people would love, please share that in the comments as well. Remember the app for shopping that makes it so easy to scan through anything that I feature. It's called LTK and all you do is at the search box at the top, you type in Busby Style and then it will say exact creator match. You tap on that and then you can shop anything that I feature there. So everything that we put either on Instagram or Facebook or YouTube, it's all there for you. Laid out super, you know, beautifully and easily. It's, I think, the easiest way to shop anything that we feature. All right, you guys. Thanks so much for being here as always. You're amazing. I love each and every one of you and I will see you next time. <laughs>